Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new video here on Swath Hub. My name is Gib Moses and in today's video, let's take a look at Litecoin against the USD. If you want a much, uh, if you're looking for a Bitcoin analysis, I highly suggest you check out my previous video. I cover Bitcoin in more in depth about this bullish flag formation and our sideways channel this video let's go ahead and talk about this pen information on the litecoin pair uh, litecoin as we know has been on a major downside move uh, this level back at 40 dollars has been our 1.61 afib level which as we know from previous levels tends to be our major demand zone right after triggering this demand zone you guys can see that we went for a major continuation to the upside we're currently facing an area of resistance right within 104 dollars to approximately 132. this level is our major resistance level on the litecoin pair now let's go ahead and speak about now this major resistance level if broken above uh, do we expect further price movement to the upside um, as of now we're trading below it we're forming lower highs therefore um, there has been no confirmation of such break above until we get a confirmation break above divergence holds above volume and so on that's your key indicator that we're headed for further price movement right now we're trading within a pennant formation the way that you play a pennant formation is whichever level breaks above or pivot breaks above first whether it's our resistance level or our support level is the direction that we're headed for example, if price action breaks above our resistance level, that's your key indicator that we're headed for further price movement. And vice versa, if price action breaks below our support level, that's your key indicator that we're headed for further sell-off. And we're talking major sell-off and vice versa, a major rally to the upside. Now, something very important to note, price action that trades within the pennant, just like what we're doing right now, remains a 50-50 scenario. Our goal as traders is not guessing if we're going to break below or above our pivots. Your goal is to wait patiently, see which pivot breaks first, until we get a solid break above either pivot we act accordingly so i'll be watching this pair very carefully once we get our pivot break i'm gonna go ahead and update you all with a brand new video so without further ado <clears throat> so without further ado i hope you all enjoyed this video give you some kind of insight of what's happening in the market with that being said i'll see you all in tomorrow's video